doing this record is uh, is a, is definitely different for me than the last couple in a really nice way. Um, on the last record, Burn Burn, we did it with the four of us, and um, and I was tons, tons more comfortable in the studio on that record than I had been in the past. You know, like anything, being in the studio is it's a you know. It's a, a you know it's experience having you can't really get studio experience like anything else in any other way than being in there, um, and it takes a while at least for me to learn how to be comfortable. Might be cool the D the second time, the B minor. And, and, um, so one thing I, I kind of did differently the last couple of years is I I set up my own home studio. And that has like helped me a ton to figure out how to get more comfortable and more productive while we're recording. I know how I feel in my own home studio when I'm when I feel inspired, when I'm being productive. And it's it's a great feeling when it happens. You know, it doesn't happen every single day. Um, but then I noticed when we got together to record this record. You know, I'm someone who definitely, like most people probably, you're more comfortable when you're by yourself, working on your own. We started working on this record and, uh, you know, I started realizing that I, I'm definitely, you know, I'm not in the same sort of comfort zone, you know, in here because I have to learn sort of to get into that same creative space when we're here and when there's other people around. So that's kind of a challenge that I've really, I sort of, you know, acknowledged, okay, I have to learn how to like tap into creativity and all that while we're here when I'm just not by myself. So I've kind of been experimenting with that on this record. And in a way, I think I've kind of driven my bandmates crazy a few times.